Hello, my name is Dr. Adrienne Hicks, and I am the founder and professor of the USMLE Master System. Today I'd like to address a question from a student asking, how do I master the anatomy for my USMLE step? The answer to that question is master your neuroanatomy. Neuroanatomy is huge on the exam. So focus on certain aspects such as the cranial nerves, the circle of Willis, as well as the brachial plexus. Make sure you can draw these out so you can know where the branches of each thing come from and what they go to. Make sure you're able to notice them on a gross specimen of the brain as well as how the brain will look on an MRI. Make sure you understand that if there are any deficits of a blood vessel, would a nerve be affected? So neuroanatomy is actually a huge part of the exam, but other anatomy aspects are on the exam as well. Make sure you know the anatomy of your bones. Know the arms and the hand as well as the leg and feet. These are bones on which they will cover. They may give you a picture or they might ask you if a part is lesioned or broken, what other aspects would be affected. Make sure that you are able to understand the embryology of certain aspects, such as the GI system, as well as reproductive anatomy of the male and female. So not every form of anatomy is covered on the exam, but make sure you understand these. Know the CT scan of a normal person, and then if they give you an abnormal picture of the abdomen or the pelvis, then you'll know what's not supposed to be there. So, Keep those questions coming. Send them to questions at usmlemastersystem.net.